Hey guys, Silence Hill here. Welcome back to another Utah Macross Gacha video. This time around, we have a very unique situation. It has never happened before. I guess Dana is starting to tweak around um, the uh, standard usual schedules and decided to spice things up with unusual methods uh, that most players who have started the game since the beginning until now have never seen before mainly because well macross crossover live is just five days away and with macross crossover live coming we are definitely to be expecting events based off that current hype that is going on right now which is macross crossover live if you guys don't know during the last broadcast of macross gatomoranai um this was shown and yes a whole bunch of episode plate gachas are to be expected with episode plate images of the divas in their macross crossover life key costumes and yes the costumes are belonging to the very first one which is the key art one if you guys have not seen all the three different key arts here they are and of course well if you're excited for all these costumes you definitely want to save up your singing stones especially since there is actually a discounted gut, uh, singing stone pack available right now there is one for the 500 singing stones then also of course there's the 1000 singing stone packs as usual so if you if you are capable of purchasing these packs please go ahead and please hold back on using those singing stones um, because well, Dana has actually been kind enough to us to actually not have a Red Boss event this month and extended the exchange rate for the um, the episode plates within the Chaos Exchange for the Red Boss event itself. So, if you have not watched my previous video, let's move on to the Chaos Exchange page so I can explain to you guys what I am actually talking about. So here we are, and of course, as usual, we are here at the Chaos Exchange for the Red Boss event. And if you notice, the very last plate that is supposedly to be um, out of the list, which is the Macross Frontier one, um, has been extended to the expiration date of 30th of June. Initially, this plate was supposed to expire on the 31st of May. Um, sadly to say, because of the um, absence of the Red Boss event for this month, which is May, um, Dana has decided to push back the expiration because of Cross Crossover Life and of course of all the upcoming events that Dana has installed for us. So with that, it's a very exciting month. Um, and also that um, we are actually coming close to um, Uta Macross second anniversary because the game actually started in August. We are just two months away from the anniversary for Uta Macross as well. So lots of things coming up soon for Uta Macross and of course any Macross fan out there, there is a lot, a lot of hype going on now. Not just because of Macross Crossover Live 2019, there is also the Kawamori Expo. Uh, if you are fans of Macross, you will definitely know who Kawamori-san is. And of course, um, there is the fashionable uh, Macross that's coming up as well, which is themed around Valkyrie. So Macross Delta fans, you are definitely in for a whole bunch of new merchandise. Then there is also the um, the stuff that's coming out for the Macross fan club, which is the official one. Um, Ebata Sama has actually drawn an illustration of Valkyrie as well, so definitely expect a whole bunch of Valkyrie merch for the fan club itself as well. So wow, Macross Delta fans, your wallet is in a <laughs> is in a danger zone right now for a whole uh, world of emptiness uh, <laughs> when it comes to unloading your cash for all this merchandise. Hopefully you are able to purchase them even though through the most expensive means of maybe Yahoo auctions. Anyway guys, we are here for the main gacha which is Makina. Um, surprisingly enough, her costume has no event related to it so I guess uh, sadly to say, Maki Maki is a bit left out. <laughs> but anyways, let's take a look at the episode plate that is for Makina and see whether um, it's actually worth your money to invest um, in the Singing Stone packs that are not discounted if you have the extra money to do so. Um, for, sadly for myself, I am not that rich so I am definitely not able to pull more than I should because I want to 
save up my senior stones for the Macross crossover life gachas. There are four different ones and yeah that's gonna take a lot of money so hey <laughs> guys um immediately you can see they are promoting makina's plate and wow a total of 3606 um in terms of score so immediately you can tell this is definitely one of makina's better plates because of total score almost well balanced stats all around um and of course, the four divas equipable with the episode plate. It looks almost like an episode plate that is uh, for general use, like those event exclusive episode plates. Like we can expect the Macross Crossover Life ex episode plates to be equipable by all the divas, unless they decided to split them up because, well, each episode plate has three divas on them, uh, even though there are a total of 10. Um, so probably one of the episode plates might consist of. Uh, for the vast equipable with the episode plate but you know because most of the time event exclusive episode plates or those with special illustrations they always tend to end up being equipable by all 10 divas themselves so do take note of that that's one of the reasons why you might want to save up your singing stones for those gachas instead of this one currently so yeah if you don't have a good makina plate i guess this one is the one to aim for because it is definitely um, in the high total score factor so I guess if you need an episode plate right now to up your um, great your Uta rate up and of course your personal high score achievements um, this plate is definitely looking towards the direction of a must want all right center skill the life element plates total is in boosted by 60% up so yeah if you have um, a setup of blue element plates on your center diva along with this one um, definitely all the stats total for the blue element plates are going to be boosted by 60% up which is a lot um, especially when it comes to achieving for high score so from what I can see I think Makina's plate will have an active skill that boosts high score so yep there it is all right active skill for 10 seconds your score is boosted by 100% up so let's take a look at the live skill itself it's also an S rank and um, with that said, I think Makina's plate is safe to say it is definitely a must get for any Makina fan and especially for those who are achieving high scores. Um, so yeah, at a 30 second mark for trial seconds, you will have an easier time tapping notes. So Makina's plate also helps in terms of practicing for difficult songs. So wow, I didn't expect Makina to be actually this useful. So I guess if if this split ever uh, uh, happens again, I mean like reoccurs or reissued again, um, I definitely might um, invest some money into it and try and obtain it. And even maybe if I got a single copy, I might even use a rarity up star for this plate's evolution as well. Um, sadly to say, Leia, I, I actually waved over it earlier. <laughs> so um, no, no special notes attached to the plate, but I, with all the skills and the stats alone, this plate is awesome enough if it actually has a special note attached to the plate it is definitely a must get um, because so far most of makina's plates um are pretty useful in terms of um, special notes attached to it um, she doesn't really have good stats plates i guess except for one other one um yeah so this is definitely adding to the collection for makina fans in terms of useful plates for makina itself right, how many times have i said makina throughout this video already so anyway guys um let's do this i'm gonna do a single template pool for makina um i don't want to go overboard with it um, just hopefully to get the points to unlock her costume so eventually in the future i might use um those episode ops to fully unlock a costume um for video purposes i suppose so anyway guys here we go let's do this one single template pool i know some of you guys out there have already done the pool and are pretty lucky so hopefully um with my terrible luck out of the way i might be able to obtain martina's plate hopefully uh, here we go so one two three four five so there might be a chance for a rainbow box but you know we oh we've got the rainbow box off the black bat on the first blink so <laughs> i don't know <laughs> it might not be makina's plate um that has been the case most of the times <laughs> all right so let's see let's skip oh we do get a new plate okay here we have the rainbow box straight off the bat and it's not makina's plate but we do get kaname's uh plate it's not one of her best plates now because kaname's um, got better plates than this one 
Um, but it is definitely one of the u useful ones, I suppose, if in terms of ticketing events, because that plate actually produces more blue notes. Alright, so skipping out all the common stuff. Um, here we go, the only red box. So no evolution there, we get Ray Ray. Um, although it's a Makina Gacha, but okay, that's fine. <laughs> Alright, so we do get a few bunch of new plates that has Makina's costume points, which is fantastic. Alright, so here we go. List of plates that probably evolved and of course, secret bots. As you can see, my Kaname 6-star plate has now gone to secret bot level 4, which is a plus 4 luck, which is fantastic. Okay, so yeah, if you want to take a look at the plate, yes, this one comes with the blue note attached to it. Here we go. So it's a 15 um, points for the item, which is a pretty fantastic amount. Alright, so not a bad episode, uh, not, not, not a bad pool, not an episode plate, <laughs> not a bad... I mean, it is a, not a bad episode plate and it's not a bad pool either, so um, yeah, we do get quite a few points for Makina's costume. I don't think I'm able to unlock her costume at this point in time because I did kind of use up um, quite a bit of episode ops um, on um, Milane's costume and Basara's costume for the previous event. Um, I kind of wanted to unlock them because they look very nice. Uh, got a soft spot for white costumes. <laughs> uh, yeah, so um, let's go and take a look. Um, I don't know. Let's try. I guess let's try um, and unlock Makina's costume. It is somewhere around the two third line, so that might be a chance, I suppose. All right, let's try and do this quickly. Whoops, wrong button. There's a problem when you have something there in the way. Okay, so I think there is no more points for this plate itself unless let's scroll all the way there is. Okay, let's do this. Alright. Okay, moving on to the next one. Oh, this one fully evolved? Wow. Okay, I didn't even see a duplicate copy. Yeah, I wasn't paying attention. Oh well. Okay, just a bit more. Right, moving on. Okay, this one should be just this. Alright, that's it. Okay, let's go ahead and move on to the episode ops um, page juice. Um, as you can see, I've kind of reduced quite a bit. I initially had like 16 large episode ops. Now I'm just down to 4, so I don't know, it doesn't seem like... I think I might be able to do it. Let's try, let's try, let's try. I think I might be able to. Okay... Oh! Oh, we do! We do cross the 12, 000, uh, 1200 point mark. Okay, so that's pretty fantastic. Uh, I'm just going to use one. Uh, and I did 8 small ones, which I have. Alright, so... Eight small ones. Uh, let's let's take two hand then minus two. Okay, so I'm definitely depleting all my episode ops right now. So I I'm, I'm a bit worried for my future Ranka costumes that I might not be able to unlock on time. I don't know. <laughs> um, but yeah, I might do desperate things for my waifu. So who knows? Anyway, guys, let's unlock Makina's costume. Um, yeah. So I think I've completed all the blue bloom sets, maybe. <laughs> Absolutely kiawa <laughs> wa. Alright, so um I know so I know Franklin and Macross Space Time the Culture has already unlocked and even uploaded a video of Makina wearing her blau bloom. Um and it's it's the I don't know, but to me personally, when I watch that video, um, Makina actually kind of dances differently from the other two divas when wearing blau bloom. Um, she acts a bit more um, nozomi, <laughs> if that is actually a term. Um, yeah, she she acts a bit more like nozomi in the dance, um, and and acts all uh, I don't know. 
clumsy cute kind of style so uh, if you guys want to check out what I mean please go ahead and move uh, move yourself over to Macross FaceTime the culture join us on the Facebook group if you have not uh, links in the description down below and thank you guys so much for watching hopefully you've got better luck than I did and did not have to toss episode ops like I did uh, because it is painful to use all these especially since they are pretty di difficult to obtain um, yeah so anyway guys thank you guys so much for watching once again uh, hit the like button to let me know if you like what I shared as usual and of course subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed just yet and I'll see you guys in another few hours I suppose because I'm going to go and do a hit uh, go ahead and record that video for the chaos exchange episode plates available for the month of May because I need to do it before I actually fly off to Japan for my cross crossover live which is tomorrow oh my god I'm running out of time and I have not even packed my suitcases uh, anyway guys bye